Hospice Work and Palliative Care for Children and Adolescents, a guide for families. Many people in Germany suffer from severe illnesses. Even young people can fall ill with life-threatening diseases. When doctors suspect a serious illness is occurring in the womb, in a newborn or infant, or in childhood or adolescence, doctors try to diagnose the condition. The search for the exact cause of the disease is a time of immense uncertainty and distress for the affected child and family. Sometimes, despite all efforts, it is not possible to identify the disease. And even if there is a diagnosis, uncertainty remains as the illness has an uncertain outcome, creating insecurity for both the affected child and their family. This is because many severe childhood diseases are rare illnesses that we are still learning about. Predictions about the child's development, the outcome of the disease, or their chance of recovery becomes guesswork. If a child is critically ill or suffering from an illness that is likely to reduce life expectancy, pediatric hospices and pediatric palliative care offer vital assistance through a wide range of supports. Most children with life-threatening diseases receive comprehensive care. At children's clinics, from pediatricians in private practice, and even through outpatient care services. Families can also use the services offered by child and adolescent hospices and pediatric palliative care from the beginning of the illness. The goals of children's hospices and pediatric palliative care are to improve, or at least maintain, the quality of life of both the child and their family while supporting their engagement in daily activities. This is accomplished by providing companionship and assistance where needed, by helping with everyday tasks, having supportive conversations, and providing relief from distressing symptoms of illness, such as pain or breathlessness. Physical, psychological, social, and emotional aspects are treated equally. Family autonomy is at the center of any action. Family resources are strengthened and an individual network of helpers is established and coordinated by consulting with the families. At home, outpatient hospice services and a specialized outpatient pediatric palliative care team can be helpful. Trained volunteers at the outpatient hospice service support families in their daily lives. They spend time with and pay attention to the sick child, as well as their parents and siblings. They may help with administrative tasks, go for walks with the sick child, or bring their siblings to sports. The Specialized Outpatient Palliative Care Team, also known as the Specialist Ambulatory Team, consists of nurses, doctors, and psychosocial professionals. They all have extensive experience in treating symptoms like pain or breathlessness. The specialist ambulatory team supports the helpers on site and is available for families 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Outpatient hospice services and specialist ambulatory teams are always available when needed, including at the end of life. For children and young people who have been suffering from a serious illness for a long time and who often experience a roller coaster in their condition, freestanding pediatric hospices offer respite from everyday life, a reprieve for parents and siblings, and an opportunity to connect with other families. Unlike adult hospices, where people are only cared for at the end of life, Pediatric hospices also take responsibility and serve as a point of contact for families throughout the duration of the disease, which often lasts for years. Inpatient short-term care facilities offer a respite from everyday life, giving sick children a holiday and families an opportunity to regain their strength. If the symptoms of the disease become very distressing for the child, or if the disease progresses, the child could be admitted to a pediatric palliative care unit at a hospital to alleviate suffering, shape their life, and then return home. In pediatric palliative care units or pediatric hospices, families may receive support during the terminal phase of their child's illness. Families decide when to contact pediatric hospices and pediatric palliative care services. Whether it is after diagnosis, during the illness, as the disease worsens, or at the end of life. 
we are always ready. We are here for families with a baby, child, adolescent or young adult with a life-threatening illness. You can rely on us.